Now I want to talk about another common business planning mistake, and this is not being decisive and wanting to start many businesses and then somehow vaguely connecting them. So for example, this focus synergies, making vaguely connecting different ideas pieced together in a very awkward way. I'll give you an example. This is from a real client, a salon with a coffee shop, with childcare, and then it like went on and on. It like to help a community, to give back and so and so, and they're gonna donate and blah, blah, blah. Fantastic business, but what is it? First and foremost, it's a salon, right? You've got to plan it as that. The other things are just features, kind of. If you plan a childcare, it's different than planning a salon. It's different than planning a charity for, to give back to the community. They all have their quirks, ins and outs, and the original way is just to confuse yourself and others. So singular focus is the key to success. You can grow into your bigger goals later, but you've got to stay singularly focused early. I know it's hard. I've been there myself. I've made that mistake before. And I've seen it many, many times. Imperfect decision of what you should choose. You can make a mistake. It, there's no guarantee that you'll choose the right option. It's possible that, you, that you'll make a mistake. But that indecision and that hodgepodge, the vaguely connecting different ideas, is often worse than making a bad or imperfect decision because any one of those businesses is probably pretty good but the combination of them is terrible because it's unmanageable it's just not executable early so decide stick with it and be open to change direction it's it's not bad usually